Hello, welcome. You're watching Headset VR. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another gaming video. And today I'm going to be playing something completely different. I have decided to give a go to Like a Dragon Ishin, which is one of the Yakuza games. But this one is a standalone story, nothing to do with any of the others, and it's even made in Unreal Engine. So, let's give it a go, shall we?時代を動かすはずの男が時代遅れの男に切られ死ぬしかもこの世に存在しないはずのもう一人の自分に切られることになるんやからなあなあ坂本龍馬さんよ Okay, so this is the game. As you can see, it is in third person. The graphics look majestic. It's set in 19th century Japan. So if you're into games like Ghost of Tsushima, or you've perhaps enjoyed Sekiro, I mean, this probably isn't on the same difficulty level as Sekiro, but it's kind of, you know, sword fighting. Samurai, that kind of thing. So, if you know, you enjoyed those, then you might well enjoy this. But also, you might want to have enjoyed potentially some of the Yakuza games because this does have a lot of toys with Yakuza because it is a spin off, a separate story. Right, so let's see if we can get this into first person, first of all. The left stick on the controller, and it puts us into first person. Reset the camera with the right stick. Okay, so right now we've got the game in first person. Let's see if we can play this, first of all, oh, with motion controllers. But we need to get UEVR up and running first. 
So you want to get this going in open XR, native stereo, and we'll just inject to that. There we go. So okay, so I've put my headset on, and we're in the game in VR. It's looking pretty good so far. Okay, so let's get rid of the UEVR menu and let's come out of the pause menu and let's pick up the touch controllers right so using motion controllers I can't see my feet or anything like that so let's go show advanced options Let's have UI follows view, so I can always see the map. Right, let's recenter to view, set standing origin and set standing height. Right, now this seems to work okay in skip draw from what I can see. So we're going to leave that as it is. Use pawn control rotation. Can I, now, can I switch third person and back again on the controller? And I can reset the camera as well. So, yeah, we can um, play this third person in VR. Or we can go first person. The disable VR key, I like having that. In case there's bits like cutscenes and things like that. According to what they say in the Discord channel, you need to turn off volumetric clouds. Ah, okay, volumetric clouds. Right, so there's volumetric clouds. Make sure you turn that off. But otherwise, this looks pretty crisp in the headset to be honest hello can I pet your dog oh, it's not right well let's go and check out the village okay so for this cutscene I've got a screen inside the headset where I can see all of this and I can see the background of the game behind this. あらの一朝路を苛立たせる。女を殴った報いを受けさせてやる。この命知らずが。かかってこい。ぬるま湯育ちのお前らに痛みでも教えてやる。Okay, so here comes combat. And we're in third person of the combat, which is good. So Well, that was pretty easy. 
悔しいと思わないのか。そこまでだ。まさか。江戸に追わす大殿。山内陽道の懐刀。とでも言えばわかるか。悪いがこの石ころわしの方で引き取らせてもらうですがしかし私がこの土佐で最も規律に厳しい男だということを知らぬわけではあるまいなそれはもちろん裁きとなる前にこの手で殺したいのじゃこの無礼な承知捕まずいました。Oh, okay, right. So after that long ass cutscene. We can now look at the map, so this looks like it could work pretty damn well, although it did look like there was a bit of displacement just with the uh, camera. Now I believe if you go into, Ooh, where are we, here and enable near clip plane, that might sort it out. It might not, but I'm told it might. So okay, we can look. Oh, now I don't know whether the quest buttons will actually work here. Back into first person. Oh. Eh? What are you wanting in a way? That's a bit shady. Oh, interesting. What's he put in it? Ointment! Just what I always wanted. Right, let's pop into first person. Now, apparently, we're after some grub, so. Oh, well, I don't seem to have the money for anything, really. Um. Okay, maybe I'll do. I need to sort the UI out. I can't see uh, the menu in the corner. Oh. Head to the schoolhouse. Now let's not talk to him. Let's just this random person here. He wants me to chop firewood for him. Well, I'm not really sure whether that's what I really want to do. 
Okay, right, so I'm going to keep this video nice and short, and he's offering me to chop him some... He's offering me to chop him some wood. So let's chop a little bit of wood, and then... Oh, I've missed. And then, and then we're going to end the video there. Oh! Boom, there we go. Right, well, I think I've done enough wood chopping, so I'm just going to end this video right here. So you've been watching Headset VR playing Like a Dragon Ishin in UE VR, which looks like it's got quite a lot of promise. So if you like what you're seeing, hit the like button. Please subscribe to the channel. You'll see a lot more UE VR content like this. Anything you can get into your headset will put on this channel. Otherwise, if you've got any comments you want to make, please put them in the description below, and I'll respond to every comment possible. Otherwise, well, I've had enough. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you for the next one. Bye-bye.